going on, everybody? This is John Bain. I want to welcome you to Conan Exiles. Looking forward to having fun with you guys today like we do every day. Hoping that you find something that you like. If you find something that you like, don't forget to slam the like button. It does help me a lot, and I really do appreciate it. And if you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe. Always got something new coming out for you. Love for you to be here when it happens. And we are back with the Conan. And this is a modded series we have begun. I had spoken with some of the other content creators about over a month ago about doing a modded one, looking at some mods and stuff like that. And we've got a mod list down below in the link for you to check out. And, um, yeah. So, uh, I haven't quit the other series, uh, completely or anything like that. Just that I'm on, when I'm on, there is nobody else on. And I'm kind of stuck on what to do. And, uh, by myself, and I'm be repeating things so badly that... Uh, I didn't want to do that to you guys, and so I, I opted towards the side of not doing anything uh, at all than that. And then I was like, you know what, we'll go, I'm going to go ahead and put the modded up. So we are here with the modded. Uh, the, like in the other series, we'll probably continue when there's more opportunity to do other things. But for now, we're just chillaxing here. And my goals here, there's a lot of mods, a lot of building mods. There's some other good mods in here. And my goals here are to explore everything we can with the game. And see how it goes. I mean, and do some serious building. Let's go ahead and explore this. Behold, bonded one, the very boundaries of civilization. Beyond the passage of our highways, lie the wild places of the world, where untamed savages make endless war upon each other. You cannot pass into the endless wastes enslaved. Your bonding prevents it. Return. Follow the road. Any road. All roads lead to the city. Okay. We'll go ahead and grab this water since I am thirsty and this note. I am beaten. Left to rot among the ruins of the past. There are others here. Slaves. Bandits and cannibals. Exiles from lands I've never heard of. Some of them try to scrape a life from the wasteland. Scrabbling in the rocks and sand for their own place. I cannot go on. The life that I left behind haunts me. The sun over the glittering spires of Belvaris is forever denied me. The smell of my daughter's hair. I will pass the ghost fence. And this cursed land will finally end me. To whoever reads this note, I leave the last of my water and this message. Stranger, you have my pity. You do not know how cursed you truly are. All right. There we go. There's more stuff. And it's now nighttime. This is great. It's great. Let's go ahead and what do I need for you? I need a branch. I need a stick. Oh, my God. It's so dark. Um, Let me wait till it's daytime. And I guess we'll be right back. So <laughs> you guys hold on. It's not daytime, but it is a torch. It does help out. So I figure we can come back while we're hanging out and talking. And uh, we do have accelerated rates on here, like uh, times 20 on the gathering. We have faster crafting. We have faster thrall breaking, all this other stuff to help uh, promote more builderizations and things. Uh, so we'll see how it goes. PvP is turned on, but I don't know how much that's going to happen. I don't know. Uh, I'm not going to say anything because I don't know. Um, but my goal, like I said, is to kind of like explore all things that the game had to offer. Uh, last uh, season or last Conan Evolved, we did uh, the recipes and stuff, but I'd like to get like everything, like just to see what it's like. I really haven't done that in this game before, and as much as I've played it, I feel like I deserve, you know, it deserves, I deserve, wow, it deserves that to happen. Um, you know, it would, to just check it all out. So let's continue moving along. Um, we have a stack mod from Litman on here. There's a weight mod as well, container, space mod. Uh, we have like the placement mod with the uh, overlapping that can happen. Uh, a city life is here, building mods galore. Uh, we can drag wall thralls through water mod. Just so many different things. And there's supposed to be, we're supposed to have a level mod on here, but it's been kind of acting kind of wonky. So I, I haven't really done much. Uh, I haven't like got it to work correctly on the survey words can come out my mouth when i try i really i really think so so anyway say hello to our friend hey friend get out of here our dead body hello dead body wish i could take your loots all right read your book curse this sandstorm we were forced to take refuge before the wind scoured the skin from our faces there is something in the storm beasts 
We hear the skittering of their paws outside the ruins, and their howls mingled with the screaming winds. The men are scared. I've put them to work crafting rudimentary weapons and torches from the loose stones and rough plants that dot this place. I've yet to meet a beast that liked fire, or the bite of the axe. The bite of the axe. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, so we are moving in. Uh, let's go ahead and craft us up our rudimentary stuff then. Craft one of these. We'll craft one of these. There we go. And let's put some points and attributes since we are I do have some levels. I want to get uh, survival up a little bit. And grit. And let's go ahead and get some hit points going on. And then let's do some strength. There we go. And on our feet, let's go ahead and grab the apprentice mason. Um, you can see the city life is a mod here. There's another one here. What is this one? Wooden tub. This is the savage steel one, I believe. There's a bunch of mods here, just in case you're wondering. There's a bunch of mods. Let's get the sword too, and uh, the shield suck at low levels, if I remember, unless that's changed, which I'm probably not wrong for assuming that. Let's do that. Let's put you around. Let's put you on seven. Let's put you here. Craft that up. We need some twine. Let's make some twine. Watch the crafting speed. Which is very nice. And then we'll craft one of these swords. There we go. Okay, so we now have a dedicated weapon. We have dedicated ourselves to this weapon. I, mean, I don't know how long we'll be dedicated to it because it sucks, but it, it, it will have to do what we have to do. Let's continue to get through here and get to the oasis or the whatever you want to call it. The river. I call it the oasis, the large oasis in the south. The south. So let's go ahead and get down here. Go, 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 go. And go, 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 go. And go, 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 go. All right, so let's get some bark too. There's a little bit of bark. I think one of the mods actually makes bark for us, so that's nice. Use a pick to gather bark from trees. That's very nice. We're getting levels from that. Let's see what else we have in our journey that we can do. Use a bed or bedroll. Clothe yourself. Let's do that. We need to do that anyway. So let's go ahead and craft one of these. Let's craft one of these. Let's craft one of these. And let's craft one of these. I think. There we go. So now we've clothed ourselves. Let's check something else in the journey. Kick. <laughs> there we go. We get the kick done. Okay, what is this? Dodge. So we can dodge. There we go. And then we need to slay and use a bed or bedroll. Let's make a bedroll real quick. Let's put it down. There we go. And we will update it too. By, uh, well, well, we can put it over here out of the way and leave it here just so we have a respawn in case something happens in the the lands of yore. Mama! Put it right here. All right, so what do you, we just need to kill somebody for the next step. So what else do we have? Unknowns. Okay. And you're feeling me? Okay, these are ones I've already done. So we need to slay to see what the next one is. So let's get down in here because I'm sure the little scrubby sacks are going to be coming after us here in a second. Is there any eggs? There's some eggs right there. We will get 20 eggs per egg, which is pretty nice and crazy. I hear a scrubby sack. He's fighting over there. Let's go ahead and kill one of these guys. Kill one of these guys. There we go. And let's grab stuff from it. There we go. Let's get our weapon out. That way we're a little bit more prepared, prepared, prepared. And we're over here on this side. This is the old school area where we started the very first season. You know, it might be kind of cool just to, for old times sake is to, is to get a basic building thing together. Now, my goal is last season I talked about it. I really wanted to um, was to go up north. Here we go. Let's eat some more crunchy times here. There we go. There's some more crunchy times. And it is already... The, the night and days are acting kind of strange. I have to double check that and see what their, the settings are on the server and, and change that. Okay. What do we have? We have a... Ooh, we have a, we have a gator. You gonna get me, boy? You wish you could. <laughs> we are trained in the ways of Conan Exiles. You will not. Oh, they just hit me. I was going to say you will not hurt me, but. 
Get out of the way. I do not want to die from you already. There we go. Can I get knockbacks on you, please? Form a heavy finisher with a weapon. Okay. This is kind of challenging. Sorry, guys. If... There we go. How about that? Get you dead. Get you dead, boy. Did that do it? No, it didn't. Oh, I got hit by it, but we're going to go ahead and kill you anyway. There we go. Give me all flesh. Bones and feral flesh. At least it's some crunchy times. Yeah, I think if you guys know, remember, somebody else had built a base over here. Who's the friend? A long time ago. And somebody built a base over here. And then somebody built a base over on that side, on that end. And then somebody else we know built a base down there and then over there. <laughs> a lot of bases in a lot of places. But I think what I'm going to do is just go ahead and gather up some stuff and get something together. And then we're not going to like get a whole thing put together before we go up north. We're going to get just enough gear together to move up north and set up up there. That's the goal. So give me a little bit here. We're going to get settled in. Let me get this daytime thing worked out. And we'll be right back. All right, we're back. Let's get crunchy some on this stuff here. There we go. And I've got foundations built, which we're going to raise up above the height of the grass, the, the tallest grass we got, which is about that tall. And I want to make it when I come up into here, there's a little bit of a thing like right here. There, it looks good. Let's kind of go around. Let's pick up this, get that out of the way. Don't want to leave any litter around. There we go. And let's do this for one row. And then let's go ahead and grab this. So um, I'm going to see later on if I can get a level mod on here because I'd like to get to where we have the ones that unlock everything. There's there you go. There's there's the first the first time I've actually screwed up using this new overlap, which I am not mad about. I am so glad to have that function because we'll be able to build some interesting things in the builderizations within the mechanics of what the mod allows. Uh, let's go ahead and do another row here. And let's just make some more foundations, like, like that many. And let's do a couple more of them. I'm not really sure what I'm going to build here. Just kind of get something together. Maybe have a corner and then make it turn. Like there's a four by four. This is, yeah, this, so this is the size of that. And maybe once that's done, we can go over again. Now, let's try that out. Let's do this and make it come over. Kind of mix up the build or license, you know what I'm saying? And then we can do a separate room back here. And again, we're not doing anything too fancy in my mind. I mean, I don't think anyway, but let's go and get some ceilings going too, since we probably will be burning through them. There we go. Turn this up and maybe do a four by four in here too. And that's three. So we'll go here. There's a four by four done there, and that looks kind of cool. I'm kind of cool with that. And maybe do a little tower thing. Oops, this is wrong because I can't do it like that. I have to do it a different way. Let's go ahead and destroy. I still, I am not a big fan. I mean, I like pick up the pickup mod some, but I think it's a great idea for some people. But for me, I feel like the value of having to gather resources and spend them even with the accelerator rates really makes you get out there and I'm fine with that myself I know some people don't care for it and it is what it is you know everyone has their thing I forgot about that with the corners here now if I did do this though with the I can probably overlap actually to be honest like I can take up this one like this and then put you here and so we can have a rounded corner that is a little different than what standard ones are. Let's do that on this one too. So we'll start off on this side, work out around it, remove you, and then go here, and then get this guy here. And so it kind of looks like, yeah, no, 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 we need to go the other way. We need to go the other way. We need to go the other way, guys, other way. Let's go ahead. I want to make it look balanced, so we'll start the, the wheel on the outside of the foundations on the left instead of in, on the top of it like we did. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's go ahead and go into the crafting. Let's craft up some more. Let's put this guy back down. And then start from this side and go around. So we can pick up this. 
and there's dlc on the way the new romanesque looking stuff looks amazing uh aqualonian i think it is and i'm looking forward to that look at that that's pretty cool hmm maybe on the front we can do like this for it again to add some flavor to the mix like that so that's the front of this and there's that and then here's the entrance way in i like this okay cool let's grab this let's grab the wall and maybe here we can do something as well with the other foundations that i don't have anymore so we'll make some more let's craft 10 because that's probably all i need so like this there's that side let's go to this side and then do this here outer faces in the correct direction let's also get a couple windows done i say let's do what are we low on we are low on stone okay okay uh well, that means we need to keep those but we'll we'll do this here right quick add a little entrance way coming in and then have the walls up right here There we go. Outer faces is going out. Let's do that again. There we go. Very nice. And then come right here. And this is where we will continue here and we'll make this com completely closed in except for like maybe a doorway out. Um, we could probably do the little hallway we got going here with a doorway. Let's do that, let's do that one there and then put this like this. So we can at least have some sort of protection up already. Really fond of how this is going to work too. So we're gonna have a couple different walls working here like that and then we can make some sort of way to get up that way to maybe use a so i can put a doorway across this little section here can i make it yes i can like right here let's face it like that so it looks uh, that looks that looks jacked up we gotta do the other way i want to make sure it all ties in nicely like that that looks good okay so let's queue up some more walls we're getting low on them already which is fine let's go ahead and do this one If anything, we can just make this like a closet thing. And we are out of resources. So I need to go hit up some more stone just to get some more things down. But I'm already liking how this mod is working for us. Uh, less placement collisions and uh, overlapping. I'm fine with that. That's amazing. I'm happy. So I'm going to go hit up some more rocks. And we'll come back and get to work on some more things. So you guys, you know the deal. Welcome back. And the form is coming together well. The form is coming well. And uh, we're going to go ahead and get some more pieces put up. And now, I guess I can climb up. It feels good. It feels good, actually. It feels good. It feels good. You know, it's the problem with sometimes starting a new series, too, it feels good for, like, a little bit. And then you're like, oh, we're back at this again. But I, I'm not getting that right now. I don't even have that partial, like, you know, oh, this again. It's, I'm excited to see... Again, we haven't built in the north much, and I really want to get into that more, and I'm looking forward to that. Uh, we did do an arena build um, for the Baniacs and the Baniac server, and so it, that that was a thing. But um, we haven't done like any massive like real things. So, like we did season three, we played for it was a very short season. We didn't play that much um, to really get into some stuff, and it was it was kind of buggy then, and it really was annoying at the time. They have changed the game so much since then. So it's going to be cool to be up there and, and working on stuff and getting this together. Uh, and especially with all these mods. Uh, I really, really can't wait. There's like the Desert Building, Lemurian Building. There is Exile Architects. Um, just so many different things here that we'll be able to toy around with that I'm excited about. This here. Make sure it's facing the right direction. Let's do you as well. There we go. Do you two get to make sure you're facing correctly? Is that right? Or is this right? This is right. Yes. Okay, good. This here. 
Now, um, there's a couple other really nice mods in the workshop, one of them being Age of Calamitous, and it's that's more like an all-inclusive mod. We have done it a lot on the Baniac stuff, and I didn't want to go with that this time just to kind of see what else we have out there to toy with. So it's nothing against not having that that we don't I don't like it or I got an issue with or anything like that. It's just I feel like we need to kind of spread our wings a little bit with some of the mods and just look at what everyone has to offer. So it's in there, right there. I guess I need to change out this one. I'm so I better be careful because I could die. I need to go to third person so I can do this right. And try it again. There we go. So we should be able to take out you. And put this up there. Cool. I wanted to have this going across the, the side just because. Now, if there was a mod that let us stack these below the wall height, that'd be great. Let's go ahead and I want to do like a hallway here. So we will do this. Like that. Come around to this side and get this wall up here. And I love the music in, the, in this. Uh, this has always been one of my favorite areas of music. Um, it just sounds so luscious and open and and just ready to go. And that looks okay. That looks okay. I really like how that does. Maybe we can add some pillars or do door frames across through the section. Not sure just yet. Let's get up top here now. So we've done a flat top on that. Maybe we should get some thatch roofs going on here. What do we need to learn on the feet? Let's see, go to the building, construction, and we did not get, there's Exile Architect already, there's a Stair Maker, we need to learn that. Roofer, Sandstone inside and out. Ew! And we know about that now. There's a wooden fence. Let's see, struts, wooden support beams, diagonals. There's some spikes, there's the hatches, there's the ladder. There's that. Okay, let's learn you. Let's learn you. Let's learn you. Let's learn you. Screw it. Let's learn you. Screw it. Let's learn you. Because that's stuff to learn. And we did level a lot. Because like I said, we have accelerator rates here. This is pretty accelerated. But let's just go ahead and get at least some perks going on here. There's that one. Let's throw in the uh, the survival one so we get more resources twice as fast. Earn a perk. We leveled from earning a perk. We'll get to that one. We have to cook raw meat to avoid po food poisoning now, which is pretty cool, pretty good. Let's get some grit in this. Uh, you hit 10% less stamina loss when we grow and climb. There we go. And I'll just go ahead up strength since we've, we're already starting in these. So we have a nice little mix of stats going on. So now we can craft us these guys, which uh, sandstone, that's the sandstone ramp. Oh, that'd be kind of neat to have two. Hmm. We are four across. We could do the ramps except for these little fronts. Let's try that out. Let's do the ramps. Uh, ramps here. Let's do 10 of them. Let's do 20. And I'm going to eat some bugs. Drink some water. And I'm regenerating right now too. So that's good. Let's try out the meats. I don't I never really got, a, I, you know. All right, there we go. All right, so we're now making the sandstone ramps. Didn't this have to have something else attached to it? No, it doesn't. There's those. Let's go ahead and make, I'd say, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then of the other ones, two. Where are they at? They're down lower. Where are you? Oh, there's a wedge. Oh, we have. Oh, those are thatch ones. I thought that was. Almost get excited. I thought that was a ramp one. There it is. And then we'll, we'll say 10 just to get that out of the way. Let's put you on five and let's go ahead and get these walls up here in the middle. And we're out of the wall, so I'll queue up another one. There we go. Let's eat some more meat. We get some regeneration. That's kind of why I'm spamming it. Okay, so put this on the outside there. Let's put this up here. Let's also come across the front here in a second. Uh, first though, let's get you, let's put you on three and let's see how these things line up because we should be able to walk up it. We can't. Okay. Rotate and then go down to this one. And that's a sandstone looking roof. If I ever saw one, let's do you next. There we go. Okay. So the fronts here though. We will need to do some of the thatchalizations. Uh, where are the thatchy stuff at? 
Uh, inverted, inverted, inverted looking ones. There we go right here. Let's do 10 of them. And where's the other one at? Right here, 10 of those. We're kind of burning through our mats, but that's not a problem. It's not a problem, guys. It's not a problem. There we go. Let's go and get these in the front. Pull them in. Like that. There's that. And then this is going to come in too. No, it might not. Uh, we'll hold off in doing any more of them for now. Let's get the stone. Let's get the thatch sloped roofs going. We'll do 10 of them. There we go. There's three. Round number th there we go. Let's do you next. Okay, let's try to get over this other one right here. There we go. We won't fall. There we go. There's that. And then I guess we could do some of the corners. Uh, let's do an internal corner, which I thought I saw up here. There we go. Let's do two of those. Let's see if this will attach. It will. That one there. Let's put this one here. Okay, and then we have these corners to worry about. And I think that with the inverted stuff and whatnot, we'll be okay. Let's find out. Yeah, that'll that will not work because we're trying to actually go flush against this. Um, hmm. Let's see here. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Well, maybe we could just make it a separate room, too. I'm not against that. Let's just try it. Let's try it. You got enough pieces. Don't die. Okay, good. Thank you. There's that. Now, across here. I'm thinking we need to get some things up. Um, We have doorways here. Uh, I say I don't want to do that. Let's do some pillars. Craft no stone. Okay, time to go hunting and stuff, and I'm gonna learn campfire so I can make me some meats that heal up a little bit better. So we'll go ahead and get all this done, and we'll be right back, guys. You hold on. Welcome back, and we're here, and we have it together. And I put some crazy little corner things on the front there to match up with this thing, but I don't know if I like it or not. But we're going to pull this back one because I wanted to come out one and see how it looked. Didn't look good. We'll go with this. We'll go with that. And I kind of, it's kind of weird. <laughs> There's a little steps on there, a little, little edging going on to give it some flavor. But we got it together. It looks good, I think. I think we're, we're looking nice. Uh, ooh, I missed, missed up something up there. I better fix the mess ups because that's not acceptable. That's not where I'm not well. I'm not able to say we're done if it's looking like that. That's all I got to say. Oh, let's do this. There we go. So it's closed in. I don't have ability to make ladders yet because I don't have a carpentry bench together yet. But, so we have that. And then we have a little hallway into here. And then we have this, which will be the workshop area for now. And like I said, we're not going to stay here forever. But I might as well I'll start building. You know me. We're just going to build something small. This is our small. So hopefully you guys like it. Let's get a little stairwell in the back too. I think that would be nice to do. We don't have any real view things to go look at stuff but again that's gonna push me to get the heck out of here and go to go down down the road man there we go and then we have a little space there between the workshop and the back I mean I guess we could put something here to look that way but I mean I'm not not, not worried about it we, we we will get focused we'll get focused fired but that is it this is the time I got for today hopefully you guys like what you see if you like what you see don't forget the slam like button it does help me a lot really do appreciate it share and share a like if you enjoyed it that much and well, as always, thank you so very much, and you guys have a good night.